Yo, Pierre, you wanna come out here? In New York, I'm in Rock. Hiding in my socks. What is the deal, good people? It's your boy, your big homie. Kicks guard back in the building. LD Kicks, we talking kicks today. As usual, today I want to talk about something really, really brief. Uh, this is a sneaker that you've, well, it's a silhouette, obviously, that you've probably likely seen or have seen on this channel. I'm talking about this sneaker here. Got a little dust on it. Do I have dust on it? Yeah, it's a, just a little bit, just a little bit. Uh, yeah, this sneaker right here. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, so, you guys might know already, this is the Vapor Max uh, Black or Triple Black, however you want to uh, call it. What does it say on the box? It says, okay, Black Anthrosity and Dark Gray. So, I'm <laughs> I'm going to go with uh, Triple Black. Um, that's what most people uh, reserved or name reserved. Or reserved name for this sneaker um a, a, a dope sneaker it released i want to say when the when the vapor max actually released back when uh i want to say back in march so it this it re, the vapor max released for air max day that was a sunday uh this sneaker was reserved only for Nike Lab. So, um, lo and behold, uh, thank you, Nike, and uh, uh, all the powers that there are in place for re-releasing this. This was a uh, this was a restock. Uh, I want to call it a restock, or perhaps maybe a re-release, which is why. I'm very, almost very certain that they may be doing this also with the Oreo. Um, the Oreo, you might have recalled, it released maybe about a month of a month ago, and it again only released at like uh, Nike boutiques, uh, Kith, uh, who else you got? All of those boutiques, whatever those boutiques in Manhattan, whatever the case may be. Um, yeah, so they released them there, and. I'm, I'm happy to get my hands on this. I thought it was a dope silhouette. Like, I saw a few people, you know, a, a few, how do you say, online personalities, uh, much bigger than me, much, much, big, much bigger than me. Uh, a lot of, a couple of uh, people at Complex, shout out Complex, uh, actually had this, I uh, forget the young lady, Emily Oberg. Uh, she actually had these, and I thought they were dope. And, um... Again, I'm, I'm not going to run through the silhouette uh, just 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 to talk briefly. I think I want to talk more or less about the comfort of this sneaker. I just really want to reiterate uh, uh, the comfort of this sneaker. It is so it is so very comfortable. I, I can't really say enough about this sneaker. And listen, me personally, like I make fun of my my fiance about wearing sneakers without socks and um yeah, this sneaker I have been wearing without socks for a while. Uh, like I don't, I think I might have worn a pair of low cut socks uh, with these one time. Um, every other time without socks, this sneaker is just that comfortable. Um, as you see, again, it's black. It looks gray in places. It's uh, 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 anthracite in other places whatever i think i said the name wrong before but uh, whatever <laughs> yeah so it, it's it's a dope it's a dope sneaker um uh, what do you think did you were you able to cop it is mm, still readily available you just gotta really really do your searching for it if you're really interested in the sneaker uh, a lot of um foot lockers a couple of foot actions and a couple less champ sports do have these they do have them uh in a few other sneaker boutiques uh box price 190 was the price plus tax probably about eh, 205 208 something like that so um yeah what do you think leave it in the comment section below how do you think about this sneaker what do you think about this sneaker did you cop did you not did you sleep let us know it's your boy kicks god Lifestyles to find LD kicks. We out of here.
Peace. If I had to describe Lifestyles Defined, I would say it is a dream come true uh, to have a platform where we can talk about the things that we love and we can share with people who also love the things we love the way we love and just have conversations that matter and go back and forth and grow as a community it's it's been a pleasure it's been a dream and i just want to thank everyone that's involved for rocking out with us